Up <laughs> um, this turns out to be pretty handy. They saved the plants for 200 years and they the basis of the blueprints that built this boat today in 2001. Uh, this boat was built in Rockport, Maine. She was sealed down two thirds the size from the original. After she was built, she sailed through the Panama Canal to the West Coast. She's owned and operated by what's called the Lynch Educational Foundation in Newport Beach, California. So all, all 10 crew members work for the organization in the she did three trips to Hawaii on the west coast taking high school students. The back to the canal, she she over here to buy some new work in 2012. No, no, yeah. I used to count. And the other crew, there's a captain, two mates, an um, engineer, a cook, and five deckhands. And we all live on board. We sleep here, eat here, and travel at the ship for six months at a time. Uh, there's eight paid positions and two volunteers, but even the volunteers have at least one season of college experience already. Because it's a complicated rig, even if you know how to sail. A tall ship works a little differently than a regular sailboat like that one today. So we like our, our volunteers even have some experience before we add on uh, top holes and some holes in the railing floor. So there's a lot of different things like this one. Okay, um, any questions? So you keep your powder dry. Watch your head. Yeah, that one. The other one you can go down. those mats.
Ball and chain and a half ball, cannonball. Cannon turns on the brass, bronze. <laughs> the mass is all greased up on the copper. Peak up there. Pretty interesting. It is very cool. Something 1812. This is from the War of 1812. This isn't the original though, right? No. Yeah, this yeah. was built in like 2001. Sure. To replicate, right? Yep, yep. But it's still awesome. It's still pretty cool, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go out. I thought I thought we were going to get a get a sale today. They're supposed to have two two later on. Yeah, but we thought this was it. Oh, uh, no. Uh, $65, $65 we, a pop, I think, for a yeah, ride. Yeah, we just thought we were getting a swing and deal with $6. Yeah, here you are. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry? Oh, yeah. You got it. Can you? Yeah, I don't think they had windlasses back then. So this was made in 2001, replica of the Lynx that was made in 1812, the War of 1812. Pretty cool. I told you to keep your powder dry. A few things. If there's a light wind today, maybe the boat pivot. Huh? Yeah, you yeah, gotta wait a minute. You going down that ladder? No, I don't think so. Come on up. I grab them. Got it. All right. Come on, buddy. Mommy. You're welcome. Uh, really for maneuvers that uh, it's 
certainly convenient for staying overnight. The train is 24 hours a day. So there's three officers, one for a walk. So one officer and two that can to make that all of the cabin spaces were are added to the original ship. Um, the under ship this was originally a cargo ship, so everything would have been in space. But in order to make it within the museum, we needed to add the cabin top so people could stand, straighten them out, have them enjoy. Also this cabin top. So here we are down in the cabin. I guess that would be a wood burner stove. That's just too cool. Exactly, exactly. Little bunk area. What time do you serve grog? When's the grog come out? Thanks. Yes. Yes, I'm sorry? When's the grog come out? I doesn't come out. Sorry. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Is it left hand screw? Right. Yeah, it's yeah, part yeah. of it, yeah. It was okay, kind of part of the deal. So you live on board? We do. We do. You got it. 